Good evening, everyone. Joe for jazbeeshobbyland.com with the brand new release 2017-18 Panini Select Basketball, our first full case pick your team break on a Friday. We made it to the Friday. Happy Friday to all. And thanks for uh, spending your Friday night with me. You guys can be doing anything. I appreciate you hanging out with me. Um, they're Select Basketball. Eric O doesn't collect basketball, but did us a solid by grabbing the Grizzlies and the Last Spot Mojo. There's everybody else. And here is a fresh case. Now, I say this all the time just because our, I know our basketball audience is not as huge as some of the other sports, but we want to get it there. A lot, uh, lot of big secondary market value, potential value in basketball, ladies and gentlemen, more so than a lot of other, other sports that we break here. The rookie class has been great, which also helps, of course. Uh, it's a deep rookie class. That also helps. Everyone seems to be playing well for the most part. That also helps. So, a lot of great hit potential in the basketball, which is pretty much all season long. All right, there are six boxes up front right here, six boxes on the back right there for the total, 12. Um, Next year's draft class apparently, next year's NBA draft class apparently is supposed to be really supposed to be really good as well. All right. We've got Donovan Mitchell, Jason Tatum, Kyle Kuzma, Donovan Mitchell. That might be your rookie of the year right there. All right, so we're looking for three autographs or memorabilia cards per box on average and 12 prism cards, 12 packs per box, 5 cards per pack. And hopefully a lot of big hit potential. What I am looking forward to is the uh, is the debut of a brand new parallel that they have here. It's some crazy zebra print parallel. So I'm into it. Is there a, do I have a zebra emoji in my YouTube chat? There's got to be a zebra. That's a unicorn. Where's the zebra? No zebra? Unbelievable. Come on, YouTube, throw throw us a zebra. All right, here we go. Uh, Eric, oh, for the Grizz, I think Ivan Rab is one of your big rookies. I think there's some Marcus Gasol parallel opportunities. All right, good luck, everybody. Uh, all cards do not ship. Vet base, as uh, as it indicated in the item description veteran base does not ship but um all rookies inserts prisms refractors short prints and hits obviously will all ship Philly dancing. They had, oh, they had the zebra print select soccer. Nice. I can't wait to do a lot of soccer this year too, especially when the World Cup rolls around. All right, there you go. There's Damian Lillard, Brandon Ingram, and our first autograph is 83 out of 140. Or no, our first parallel is Jerry and Grant. Well, I see how they're going to do this. That's for the Bulls, and that is for EA with the Bulls. Ramon Sessions. Tie-dye, 19 out of 25. That is for the Knicks. That'll go to Chris Parent. I didn't know Ramon Sessions was on there. There's Lonzo Ball. Obviously, these rookie cards will ship. And there's Shabazz Muhammad for the Timberwolves. I don't think these are, are numbered. There you go. Those parallels are pretty good as well. Yeah, I, I do love the tie-dye look. There's Donovan Mitchell. I wouldn't be surprised if this card right here goes for like, <laughs> like 30 or 40 bucks or something like that. That's how crazy some of this stuff can be, especially the rookies. Jazz with that one, Mark. And we've got 
X Factor, Papa Giannis for the Sacramento Kings. I don't think he's on the Kings anymore, is he? All right, that goes to the Kings. That'll be for EA Sports in the game. Nice, that Damian Lillard will ship. That is out of 75. 12 out of 75. Dame. For the Trailblazers, Jeremy 33. There's Reggie Jackson. Nice parallel as well. And there we go. 25 out of 99. Jersey and auto, De'Aaron Fox. A fox in the box. For EA Sports, it's in the game. And the Sacramento Kings. Twenty-five out of ninety-nine. And Josh Richardson. Blue for Michelle, I believe. And the Miami Heat. 215 out of 299. You've got one on Kip now, Michelle. That's one. And we got Frank Tilakina. 23, Jordan out of 49. X Factor. Nice one for the Knicks. That was a late pickup for the Knicks. Chris Parent with the Knicks. I like the design of those X Factors, too. Kind of draws your eye to the, especially if, it, if we get a nicer patch or a nicer jersey on that. I'm sure we'll find some of those. James Ennis. Nice James Ennis. Also for the Heat. Just knocking these boxes over here. Uh, for the Grizzlies, that is. That'll go to Eric O. All right, so that was box one. Nice start. Box two. All right, what's what's the latest? What's what do we have here? On the, what's the latest NBA news? Let's check the scores really quick. Let's make sure these are organized for optimal pack ripping. There we go. Let's check scores first. Second quarter. Bulls le leading the Pistons 39-36 in Detroit. Pacers working over the uh, the Hawks right now. They're up 42-26. And the Raptors-Rockets game just started. Uh, Raptors with an early lead, 14-8. 6 left in the first quarter. And uh, that's it for now. Those are the live games right now. A lot, of, a lot of other games coming up. Warriors-Trailblazers game. Looking forward to that. That should be a good one. I don't think they have Steph Curry. He tweaked an ankle. Looks like uh, Jazz Grizzlies are gonna, it's gonna start soon. Knicks Bucks will start soon. My Lakers in Denver. And uh, the Cavs playing the clip show. That's a late game tonight. A couple other games in between. All right. Speaking of the Cavs, there's LeBron. And there's uh, Malcolm Delaney. Autographs. Nice on-card auto for the Atlanta Hawks. Patrick Sullivan, you're on the board. I like the subtle uh, Hawks logo right there in a lot of this design. On-card autos. I think there's more on-card autos in this than uh, we've normally seen. 131 out of 149. I think the relic autos are, are still stickers, but I think we're going to see a lot more on-card than we normally see. There's Donovan Mitchell. Bobby Portis for the Bulls. And our first die cut for the Sixers. Furkan Korkmaz. That's 35 out of 135. 
Here's De'Aaron Fox. I'm going to try to pull some uh, as much of those rookies as possible. And rookie signatures, on-card auto Lonzo Ball. Laker Joe Bojo going out to TK and my Lakers. Nice. Lonzo Ball playing some good basketball as of late, especially since coming back from that knee injury. 111 out of 199. Nice ball. Jerry and Grant for the Bulls. Wesley Matthews, former Laker for the Mavs. And for the Brooklyn Nets, that's forward Rondé Hollis Jefferson, X Factor memorabilia. For Brooklyn, Ken with the Nets. There's Lonzo again. There's Oladipo, orange out of 75. Joel Embiid. Tyler Dorsey for the Atlanta Hawks. Blue out of 299. Tony Parker for the Spurs out of 199. That's one for Kip. Those guys right here. Uh, in the interest of time, I'm going to set these parallels aside safely. And we will, uh, I'll, I'll sleeve those after the break. Obviously stuff like this, we're gonna sleeve and top load immediately. Save that one for Twitter, at Jaspi's Hobbyland. We'll be posting that. All right, good luck. Yeah, that Lonzo Ball certainly has to be worth a, chunk, a good chunk of change, says Bruyo. I agree. Uh, his value has tailed off a little bit since the beginning of the season or preseason, but I think it's got to be ramping back up because he's playing good basketball and the Lakers are playing some good basketball too. Uh, Patrick Sullivan saying, you think it's about 150-ish? I gotta think a little bit more. I mean, I guess it's only out of 199. That sounds about. That's actually not bad for out of 199. I can see that 150, 200 around there. Depending on if you get lucky on the secondary market, find the right buyer, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. I think it'll be those lower number of parallels that'll, that'll start, you know, exponentially growing in value. What I love about about basketball products like this is that even just those even non-numbered parallels, if you especially if you get the right rookie, could uh, could sell for a lot. So you can piece together your cost of admission back pretty pretty quickly on a lot of with a lot of teams. It's Devin Booker for the Suns and Vince Sanity. Throwback memorabilia, Vince Carter Raptors edition. Nice. That goes to Toronto, Jim Gray with the Raptors. There you go, Jim. Raptors up 23-13 on the Rockets. 3-10 left in the first quarter. That game just started. I should, I should have put that on the TV here. Too late now. Um, it's Patrick Beverly for the Clippers out of 149. Slash and dash LeBron James, silver. Boyan Bogdanovich, blue. That's out of 299 for the Kings. And there's poor DeMarcus Cousins. In his free agent year, too. There's Torian Prince, 17 out of 49 for Patrick and his Hawks. He has the Hawks in this one. Brandon Ingram playing some good basketball, too. And for the Spurs, Danny Green relic for the Spurs, 91 out of 99. So I think Kip has taken the, the edge, the lead on that one, Michelle. Kip with the Spurs, 
and the Danny Green. I like the design this year. There's something a little bit different about the design, right? Subtle changes, but a lot of things that kind of draw your eye to to the center of the card and whatnot, or the relic. I think that's very good. There's Dirk Nowitzki, and there's Anuobi. Rookie signatures for the Raptors. Another one for Jim Gray and his Raptors. Paul DeYoung wondering if the Raptors won't choke in the playoffs this year. I don't. They seem like a different team, though, don't they? A lot of the same players, but it really seems like they've, like the coaching staff has made a conscious decision to play a different style of basketball. The team has responded. Their bench playing really, really good basketball, too. There's Ivan Rab, red parallel for the Grizz out of 199. Eric O with that. And Ojale out of 185 for the Celtics. It's for Landon. And nice Jason Tatum, X-Fractor, gold, 10 out of 10. This is, what is this, a million dollars right here? Landed with the Celtics. Little oppo, Joe Mojo. I'm not even kidding. This, this, You'd be surprised. You'd be stunned at how well this can do on a secondary market. Big rookie out of 10, even with no ink. There's Kawhi Leonard, unhappy Kawhi Leonard. Come to LA, Kawhi. So that's that's a that's a pretty huge one right there. That'll also be something we will save to take pictures of for the Twitter verse at Jaspie's Hobbyland or Twitter at Jaspie's Hobbyland on Instagram. I think Jaspie usually takes care of the Insta, the IG. I'm on the Twitter a little more often. All right. Watch out, select packs. Easy. Easy. Let's take a look at some standings. Basketball heating up, folks. Almost to the, I think we have less than 20 games left in the season. Less than 20 games left in the season. We've got, at the moment, Toronto is up two games on the Celtics. Cleveland in the, in the three seed, this is the East, obviously. Uh, Wizards, Pacers, Sixers, Heat, and, uh, and Bucks. Detroit, on the outside looking in, on the playoff spot, they're, uh, they're, what, five games behind the Bucks for the eight seed. Might be a little, uh, might fall short. Detroit might fall short a little bit this year. I don't think Charlotte's going to catch anybody either. The Charlotte's had a bad run of games in the last week or two. So I think it looks like Philadelphia, Sixers, Heat, and Bucks will be kind of battling for... Those three teams should be in that six, seven, eight area. Seems like, seems like, and then it looks like three, four, and five seeds for the East will be uh, the Cavs, Wizards, and Pacers will be battling for those spots. Hello. All right, hi. hi. Just right there is fine. Thank you. Okay, thank you. Bye -bye. All right, there's Chris Dunn for the Bulls. Those are not numbered, but they will ship. There's Jason Tatum again, and Nikola Vucevic. Relic for the Orlando Magic. That'll go to Alex Donnelly and the Magic. Not numbered on that one. John Wall. Injured John Wall seems to be playing, or they seem to be playing uh, better without John Wall, that is to say. Kevin Durant tie-dye. Nice Kevin Durant tie-dye. That is going to the Warriors. Warriors come out to play. Two out of 25. Nice tie-dye die cut for Jason Cox and the Golden State Warriors. There's Jerry and Grant for the Bulls. Blue out of 299. And 
Wow. Throwback memorabilia for the Bucks. Ursan Ilyasova. What a patch. Look at this. See how the see how the design brings your eye right to there? That's pretty sick. Three out of ten on that one. Milwaukee Bucks. That's Alex Carmichael with the Bucks. There you go, Alex. It's a good looking one. There's Terrence Ross. These ones aren't numbered, by the way. That's why I'm not showing the backs. There's Drew Holiday playing some good ball, too, out of 75. And Andrew Wiggins. And we've got Jerry, Jerry Stackhouse for the Sixers. In-flight signatures. On-card auto for Philadelphia. Daniel Ritter with the Sixers. There you go, Dan. Not bad for, uh, for his first break with us. 152 out of 199. That's a great start. We've got still plenty of boxes to go, too. The Lori Marketing right here out of 199 for EA and the Bulls. A couple more here. There's Taj Gibson and there's Dirk. All right, so nice box. Got the Jerry Stackhouse. We got the throwback memorabilia. Got the Kevin Durant. Pretty good stuff. Next, we're not even halfway through this case. Now we looked at the East. Now let's take a look at the West. The West is uh, is a lot more crowded. So at the top is are the Rockets and the uh, and the Warriors. The Warriors are half game behind the the Rockets at the moment. And then we have the Trailblazers, the Pelicans, the Spurs, the Timberwolves, Thunder, Clippers, uh, Nuggets, Jazz. Between the three seed and the tenth seed, there are maybe four games that separates all those guys. So you may as well just put all those teams in random.org, mix them around, and that might be... That might be your seating right there. Portland is playing great basketball. So, so are the Pelicans. Let's see how long the Pelicans keep, can keep that going with Anthony Davis just controlling everything. Spurs are a little on the uh, on the on the downside. They've lost three of their last ten, or they've lost seven of their last ten. Timberwolves also struggling with that Jimmy Butler. Uh, they're on a three-game losing streak. They're four and six in their last ten. Uh, Thunder six and four, Clippers six and four, Denver six and four, Utah eight and two in their last ten games. So they're on the ascendancy. So you might see Spurs and Timberwolves slide down as some of the other teams slide up, perhaps. But the, it'll be a very exciting finish for the West. There's poor Gordon Hayward for the Celtics. Josh Jackson. There's Ilyasova, again, this time Hawks edition out of 199. TJ saying that Ilyasova used to play for the for, in Tulsa for the, the D-League team. There's Kyrie. And for the Jazz, wow, tie-dye. Throwback memorabilia, Damari Carroll for the Utah Jazz. Whew. That looks great. Nice low number on that one, too. Out of 25, 6 out of 25. Nice. Once again, Mark with the Jazz. It's James Ennis for the Grizz. And Bradley Beal. X-Factor Relic for the Wizards. That'll go to Adam. There's Jason Tatum. There's Draymond. There's Jermichael Green. Purple die cut for the Grizz. 
Aniogbu right there too. I like sleeving up the die cuts just to protect it. The Jermichael Green going to Eric O, 37 out of 99. These ones aren't numbered. Goes to the Pacers, though. Uh, that'll be for Michelle. Michelle with the Pacers. It's Markel Fultz. There's Robin Lopez, die cut, out of 185. And Otto Porter Jr. And we've got some autograph an autographed high-die auto. Willis Reed. Nice. For the New York Knicks, Chris Parent with the 15 out of 25 Willis Reed. Nice old school on card auto. Blue Malcolm Brogdon out of 299. Jordan Bell for the Warriors. Another nice box in the books. All right. Next box, pick your team one. Thanks for joining us, everybody. Happy Friday to all. Got plenty more of this in the store, folks. So check it out on jazbeeshobbyland.com. A lot of great value in all of these cards. So check it out. My Lakers playing some great basketball lately, but... Unfortunately, they're not gonna they're not gonna get close to a playoff spot. But a lot of encouraging signs for the Lakers. Playing well. They'll be playing tonight, actually. They'll be in Denver. Arthur says the Lakers are weak. Arthur's Suns fan. Well, let's see where the Suns are. Let me scroll down. Down, down this list here. Let me keep scrolling down. Down further. Further down. Let's keep going down. Down, down the list to see where the Suns are at. With a 284 winning percentage. 19 and 48. Looks like another nice lottery pick for them next year. 1 and 9 in their last 10 games on a nice 4 game losing streak. There you go. Suns with another top pick for them. Which I'm sure they'll they'll use wisely. Jonathan Simmons out of 299 for the Orlando Magic. There's Donovan Mitchell, nice Donovan Mitchell right here for the Jazz. I'm sure that'll that'll have a lot of value there too, Mark. There's Donovan Mitchell again. Uh, Dwayne Dedman. And Turkan Korkmaz. For the Sixers, nice die cut. That's for the Sixers. 18 out of 65 for Dan. Another die cut down there. And the die cut is Jordan Clarkson. Still Lakers edition in this set. Out of 185. I like these inserts too. The Phenoms. That looks pretty cool. There's De'Aaron Fox, Trevor Booker, and we got John Collins. Rookie signature. Isn't this what you were looking for, Patrick? Patrick Sullivan with the Atlanta Hawks. One eighty two out of one ninety nine, Atlanta Hawks. Nice. There's Steph Curry out of 199. Bum ankle tonight. I don't think he's playing tonight. There's Oladipo. And we've got another Bradley Beal X Factor. Wizards. Another one for Adam. There you go. Patrick's happy. There you go. And Jason Tatum, X-Factor, nice. 
for the Red, uh, Red Sox. Boston Celtics, not the Boston Red Sox. I've got baseball on the brain. There you go, 45 out of 49. Nice Jason Tatum relic. Goes along nicely with that uh, that X Fractor we had earlier. Earlier, that goes to Landon and the Celtics. All right. Halfway through this full case break, folks. I think we're doing pretty well on time. Good luck, everybody. Suns could be a sneaky good team, though. Speaking of the Phoenix Suns, um, they've, they've got some great individual talent on that team. If they had a, you know, Josh Jackson is actually not playing. Uh, it could, you know, is not playing that bad, especially in recent months. They get another lottery pick up there. They could, they could put it all together. Memphis. They're they're zero and ten in their last ten games. They're on a fifteen game losing streak. I don't know. Uh, I don't know if they're as close. <laughs> they're gonna need a lot more than just one or two more picks. There's Donovan Mitchell rookie card. Brandon Ingram out of two ninety nine double oh seven out of two ninety nine for the Lakers. Brandon Ingram playing some good ball. And Kobe, Kobe Bryant, Sparks, Hall of Famer Kobe Bryant. Multiple uh, NBA champion, Kobe Bryant, and now Oscar winner, Kobe Bryant. Frank Tilakina, Markel Fultz, nice. Fix that shot, Markel. Got to fix that shot. Then we got Bobby Portis, 007 out of 135. Oh, Paul, you're a Suns guy too? You'll fit right in with Joe P. and Arthur. They're Arizona. They're, they're Suns guys too. I don't know why they put up with me here with all this Laker talk. There's Dwight Howard and Spud Webb for the Hawks. In-flight signatures, Spud Webb, 5'7", 133. And he, could definitely, he definitely had hops. Patrick Sullivan with the Hawks. Nice on-card auto. 103 out of 199. Got Garrett Temple to 149. And there's Etwan Moore for the Pelicans. And... I like these all-world cards right here. These will ship, too. These are pretty cool. For the Hawks, obviously. Dominique Wilkins. And we've got Yogi Ferrell. 30 out of 99. X-Factor. For the Mavs. Mavs on the board. That's for Bruce. Thirty out of ninety nine on that one. We got Wayne Selden Jr. for the Grizz out of seventy five for Eric O. Justin Patton. Some Darius Thornwell and Malcolm Brogdon. Grizz racking up the Eric O. Racking up the parallels. Nice Spud Webb. All right, next box. 
Uh oh, Paul DeYoung saying, I uh, started PCing Marquise Chris last year. <laughs> Too bad he's having a terrible second year. Arthur has confidence in him, though. Coaching is the big thing, too. I don't know who the Phoenix Suns coach is. Is that someone that fans like? Arthur and Paul and Joe? Because if... Because that's all. That's what it takes. That coach just brings can bring all that together. That could be be pretty good. Oh, you don't like the coach. Okay, so maybe some players, maybe some new coaching. Sorry about that. All right. Last pack out of here. Is that Dominique Wilkins a case hit? Are those are those only one per case? The all world cards? Maybe. What, is it, what does it say in the checklist? I don't think it is. The all-world set, well, it doesn't say one way or the other. I think it's probably more common than one per one one per case. Yeah, all world silver, all world gold, a number blah blah blah. I don't know. Um, I mean, it's a nice hit. I don't think it's a case hit though. I think there's probably more than more than one of those per case. I think. I don't know. Maybe it is. Maybe it's a little more rare than I thought. Wilson Chandler. Nuggets die cut, 77 out of 135. And for the Cavs, Cavs are going to love this. Kevin Love, that goes to Jason Cox and the Cavaliers. Yeah, let's count. Super short print, huh? That makes more sense. There's Kevin Love. We'll keep track of these. We'll set that right there. But if that's going for $80, yeah, there, there can't be too many of them then. Harry Giles for the Kings. Another all-world, Steve Nash. There's two. There's Marquise Chris. We were just talking about him. His ears were burning. He heard us. And Trey Lyles for the Nuggets. X-Factor. My Lakers facing the Nuggets tonight. Nuggets belong to Robert. There you go. There's the Trey Lyles. Terrence Ross for the Magic. And for the Suns, there's Josh Jackson, 11 out of 199. Jersey and autograph. Nice one for the Phoenix Suns, Dubberly with the Suns. Eleven out of one ninety-nine. Oh, I see. Yeah, the Nash is just a regular one. But the Wilkins definitely is the, the prism, is the refractor version. You can tell the difference right there. I got you. Well, that helps pay for the spot for the for the Hawks. Patrick, it's nice. There's Caleb Swanigan out of 149. 
Uh, 84 out of 149. Trailblazers, that'll go to Jeremy 33. There's Tyler Ennis out of 99. Die cut for my Lakers. TK with my Lakers. There's Alex Len, John Luer, Markel Fultz. And there's John Luer. Blue. Oh, that psyched me out. I thought it was going to be an autograph. 33 out of 299. Pistons. There you go, Mike Coons. Justice Winslow. Justice is served. And Al Farouk Aminu for the Portland Trailblazers. All right, and Paul needs a uh, Paul needs a Josh Jackson in the next case too. All right, next box, just four boxes to go. Uh, what's the Justice Winslow parallel called? That's something like Sparkle something or other. Oh no, this is the one. This might be Scope. Let's see what the name. Let's see what the names are. Yeah, there's silver, which is just the refractor scope. This must be the scope. I think these are your tricolors, if I'm not mistaken. The zebra we have not seen yet. We've seen. Um, we have not seen any pink. Those are out of four. So I think that's what that's what it is. But yeah, I like to call them crop circles instead of scope. Scope. Okay. I mean, that's a mouthwash, you know. Crop circles, though. That sounds more mysterious. This break brought to you by Scope. Yeah, pinks are out of four, uh, at least on the base card level, so... Those will be those those will certainly be harder to find. All right, next box. Good luck, folks. We have we have more pick your teams on the site, jazbeeshobbyland.com. We also have half case random team breaks if you're interested in that. For the Clippers, Blake. Sparks Relic, Blake Griffin. Uh, Juan with the break, with the Blake, that is, not the break, the Blake. 43 out of 99. There is uh, uh, Jalen Jones, Joel Embiid. Bam Adebayo, Tricolor. Die cut for the Nets, Damari Carroll. 133 out of 185. Kevin Durant, scope, or crop circles. And Frank Jackson, 179 out of 199. Rookie signatures for the Pelicans. I'm sorry, Miss Jackson. Ooh, I am for real. For the Josh Jackson. Now the Frank Jackson. This one goes to the Pelicans. Robert. There's James Ennis out of 299. There's Korg Maz for the Sixers. There's Markel Fultz. Yeah, we've not seen a zebra yet. I well the cardboardconnection.com seems to indicate that there's three per case, but maybe that's not true. I guess we'll find out. Uh, there's Daniel Theus out of 299 for the Celtics. There's Dirk for the Mavs. And Alfred Payton, Orlando Magic. Magic Relic going to Alex Donnelly.
There's the maker of Thons, Thon Maker. 80 out of 99 for the Bucks. Nice one for the Bucks. That'll be for Alex Carmichael. All right, just three boxes to go. Oh, you're welcome, Hub City. I'm surprised at, I'm kind of surprised at how well the Clippers have been playing without Blake Griffin. That could be an interesting game against the Cavs tonight. Cavs battling for seeding too. The Cavaliers have essentially been going through training camp, I guess, with all the new players there. We'll see how they finish off the season. I can't believe there's only like 17, 18 games left. Not very many games left in the basketball season. And then playoff time. Playoffs are always exciting. Playoffs. What's great is that we'll see the likes of these rookies like, like Jason Tatum showcased. Joe Johnson for the Jazz out of 199. Uh, we'll see, we might see Markel Fultz in the playoffs. And there's Jimmy Butler, throwback memorabilia. We will not see Jimmy Butler, I'm afraid. And the Timberwolves are playing good basketball. This is Bulls edition. This will go to EA Sports in the game. Even those rookie cards have some value. Well, especially the silver ones, but I've not seen too many refractor rookies yet. 8 out of 65, Goran Dragic. Green die cut for the Heat. That'll be from Michelle. I've lost count, Michelle. There's Gord poor Gordon Hayward. Myers Leonard and Gorgie Dean, speaking of Timberwolves. Signatures for the T Wolves. That'll be going to Jim Gray and the Timberwolves. Nice, Jim. 116 out of 149. Poor DeMarcus Cousins out of 299 for the Pelicans. Poor DeMarcus Cousins. We've got, so these are the silvers. We haven't seen any of the big rookies with that silver parallel yet. It's Miles Turner, Pacers. And we've got Devin Harris, X Factor for the Dallas Mavericks. Bruce with the Mavs. Got another die cut coming up. LeBron James die cut. Nice. Cavs. That'll be Jason Cox with the Cavaliers. Out of 185. And the last bit here. Tyler Ennis. And two boxes to go. How, how are we doing on basketball scores here? Uh, Paul Young asking, is there an actual reason why Prism Silvers and Prism Overall is a higher value than Select Silver and Parallels? Or at least sell better on a secondary market. I like the look of Select better. Um, I actually don't know. You know it might, might just be, uh, you know, it might just be collector preference over the years, I guess. I think, uh, is it odds, Patrick? Maybe, maybe, yeah, maybe it's less common in Prism. I think Prism is general. I like Select too, but if we if we were to split hairs, I think Prism is 
is well regarded as more of a uh, a more of a flagship kind of product. You know what I mean? Like if you're looking for like if you're looking for like the rookie card for that one guy that one year, you know, a lot of people will probably turn to contenders basketball or or prism. It's a little more. I think it's a little more flagshipy, if you will. I'm sure, there's a better reason for that, but but I, I think that's a big part of it. Like I think like like watch like different um like watch like different uh like buyback products. You know how like Leaf, TriStar, and uh and Super Break will have those buyback products. Look at the look at the graded cards that come out of those sets like that. They're generally if the generally the rookie cards tend to be, especially for basketball, Prism, Contenders, stuff like that. Those are the more highly desirable ones later in their careers. There's Devin Reed. There's Red Joe Johnson out of one ninety nine. And a nice tie-dye, Chandler Parsons tie-dye for the Grizz. It's 20 out of 25. Eric, oh, Eric, I'll be honest with you. You've been racking up a lot of parallels. I wouldn't be surprised, you know, if you kind of grinded out your spot money back, if not a little bit more. Let's set that out here. Nice Markel Fultz rookie. There's Russell Westbrook, tricolor. And for the Suns, Devin Reed, 32 in the draft selections. Now, is that relic from draft night? Let me look on the back. Well, it says player warm. It's, a lot of times they have a little more detail, but it says player warm material. I wonder if this is a if this is a draft night relic. That'd be interesting. Suns with that one, Dubberly. There's Ricky Rubio out of two ninety nine, and another die cut, Giannis Antetokounmpo. Nice Giannis for Alex Carmichael and the Bucks out of one eighty five. What a great season for him. Wayne Selton Jr. and our points. Wayne Selling Jr. going to the Grizz. Another one for the Grizzlies. And wow, nice Kevin Durant. Gold X-Fractor for the Golden State Warriors and Jason Cox. Four out of ten. That'll do pretty well on a secondary market, I'm sure. There's Andrew Wiggins Blue. Out of 299. Uh, base all world, Jokic. Russell Westbrook, silver. So st vets, vets like this will obviously ship. Jason Tatum. And Malik Monk. X Factor memorabilia for the Hornets. That'll go to Jeremy 33 in Charlotte. Yeah, I think Patrick was talking about those all-world cards. You might be right, Patrick. Like the all-world cards that are that are silver, that are refractors, may may come like one per case. Not not like a guaranteed case hit per se, but like just odds wise, it might it just may not pop out very often. All right, last box. Good luck, folks. We'll do a quick randomizer at the end for that. Uh, if there's any other additional points, it'll it'll be uh, it'll be winner take all. I think we've we've been doing that for a little while. I think that works a little bit better for the points. Uh, we have not seen a zebra parallel yet. That's I was looking forward to those zebra parallels. Got to be here somewhere. All right.
Pistons still leading the Bulls, 65-57. Bulls in tank mode. Pistons just on the outside looking in for a playoff spot. Pacers still leading the Hawks by a lot, 80-53 to with a few minutes left in the third quarter. It's at halftime. Raptors up 58-43 on the Rockets. They, they're threatening to uh, to end that Rockets winning streak. Uh, end of the first quarter, Jazz leading the Grizzlies by a point, 24-23. And end of the first quarter, Bucks leading the Knicks, 26-22. I think second quarter just started in New Orleans. Wizards, three points, 24-21 ahead of the Pelicans for the moment. Lakers game starting in about 20 minutes, which will be great. All right. <laughs> yeah, Paul's saying I need to put some grass on the table. Zebras do like that. All right, let's find let's find a zebra parallel. There's Clay Thompson, out of two ninety nine. There's a nice silver Markel Fultz. That's for the Sixers, Daniel Ritter. So something like this. These are the ones where you can find some big value. I wouldn't be surprised if this goes for what hundred bucks, hundred fifty bucks, something like. That. Someone look this up. Would not be surprised. Tyler Dorsey, orange, out of seventy five. Wow, another parallel for Markel Fultz. That's pretty big. And we've got Jonas Valachunas. Nice autograph for Jim and the Raptors. Raptors up 58-43 at the half. 59 out of 99. Paul saying he hit a Josh Jackson silver, only went for 20. Markel has a number one pick, even though he hasn't played. He's got to sell a little bit better than that, right? I would think. There's Ramon Sessions out of 199. There's another all-world card. Not a silver, though. There's Josh Jackson, tricolor. Jason Tatum. Josh Richardson for the Miami Heat. Another Markel Fultz. That's the base auto. And there's Frank Mason the third. Number 34 in the draft. That relic goes to the Kings, EA Sports. There's Markeith Morris. That's out of 149. Bam Adebayo tie-dye die cut. That is for Michelle... The Miami Heat, bam, 15 out of 25. Yeah, I like the crop circles look too, Adam. Dubberly's like, I like those crop circles. I do too. Green Thought Maker. That is our first trade whistle of the day. And our first trade whistle out of Select Basketball, brand new release. Looks like a little bit of a ding at the corner at the top right there. But still a trade whistle. Three out of five. Milwaukee Bucks. Alex Carmichael all aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo woo! Love those. The maker of thons. There's JJ Reddick. And no zebra. There's Zach Collins for the Trailblazers, X-Factor. So maybe the Zebras are a little more rare than we think. Does not fall three per case. Dante Exum at the end. Well, there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. Great break, though. A lot of nice stuff. Uh, a lot of stuff to post on the Twitter. Got that Kevin Durant. Got the Spud Webb. Jerry Stackhouse. Gold, Ilasova, tie-dye Kevin Durant, Jason D Lonzo Ball, of course. Got that train whistle up in this, too. So a lot of great stuff. Thanks for getting in, ladies and gentlemen. Joe for Jaspi's Hobbyland Dog. Oh, I got these points. These points are in the way. Joe for Jaspi's Hobbyland .com. We will be setting out some grass. Maybe put an apple on the table to attract some zebras out of here. So some other case probably has six. Uh, let's go to random.org. 
bring up a list. Everybody gets a shot at the points of 250 points from Patrick down to Adam. It's got a blank list here. Let's roll the dice. Five out of five, ten times. Name on top. One, two, three, four, five. <laughs> it is legal in, in California, TJ. Six, seven, eight, nine. Nine and tenth and final time name on top, Jason Cox. There you go, Jason. You got a little extra consolation prize, a little extra stuff right here. 250 points. There you go. More cases on jazbeeshobbyland.com. We also have half case random team breaks. I know people like random teams too. So you can also see that on jazbeeshobbyland.com. Thanks very much, everyone. We'll see you for the next hoops break. Bye bye.